anyway, 78 right now here in Corpus Christi. 70s and 80s generally around the coastal bend right now. It's a little more humid right here along the coast. Temperatures in the upper 80s in Port Aransas. Heading into the rest of this afternoon, we're topping out at 100 degrees for the something if day in a row. We've set two high temperature records the past two days. Yesterday, one of the hottest days in Corpus Christi history. We hit 105. We're going to probably not be quite that hot today. We're going to get into feels like temperatures right around 110 to 115. So very, very hot. This is going to go from 10 until 7, our weather impact alert day for this excessive heat. So what you should be doing is staying cool, hydrating and taking breaks indoors, whether that's in the AC or even in the shade if you can't get inside. So it feels like temperatures are going to be right around 100 already as early as 9 or 10 o'clock and getting into the 110s to about 115 this afternoon. So very, very hot. This is why we have a heat advisory in effect for all of our counties that's going to run from 7 uh, or noon until 7. I should say this does not include the islands at this point, but it's still going to be quite hot around the entire coastal bed. Now we do have this one last weather impact alert day for today for that high temperature of 100 as well as feels like temperatures up near 115, but we are going to cool off to about near normal heading through the weekend. Feels like temperatures though staying right around heat advisory criteria. The reason we're cooling off is this high pressure moving a little bit to our northeast as well as this piece of energy right here. It's going to move across the coastal bend, promoting some scattered shower chances. They're not going to be all that high, but it could be enough to help our temperatures go down just a little bit back into the middle 90s as opposed to the lower 100s as we have been seeing. An isolated rain chance with the sea breeze the next few days and then that promoted rain chance heading into early next week. Those widely scattered showers. Otherwise, we're going to be staying hot and dry for most of the coming weekend. 100 today. We've got that weather impact alert day, so make sure you're staying hydrated and uh, practicing heat safety. 78 for that low temperature tonight. Over the next several days, we continue to have temperatures in the 90s, but I guess that's better than the 100s. We'll be again in air quotes cooling off. Anything less.